Guys, we got a few sneaker strategies for you guys. Sneaker strategy, if you are new to reselling, is that you first join a cook group. If you don't have a cook group or you don't have people that can teach you and help you and get you to learn what's going to be the right shoes to buy, what's going to be the shoe that's going to really pop, and what are going to be the shoes that are going to sit on the shelf forever that you're not going to be able to sell, what's going to be the items that are going to move quickly, and where are you going to buy the items at? So you need help in figuring out where to get the items, what items to buy, and, and that's pretty much the start of it. Now, you're gonna need some money to get started. Here's what I would suggest if you guys are young, you, you, you know, I don't wanna hear this bullshit on my channel and, my, and these excuses about, oh, I don't have money to start, how do I get started? How do you get started? You start, you start doing it, you sell, you make a sale, and you start throwing stuff up on Facebook that you don't need, eBay, Wherever you can sell stuff, you sell stuff. And, and I'm talking about old t-shirts, hoodies, jackets, shoes, anything you can sell to come up with 500 to $1,000 will be a starting point. And then I want you to do uh, tip number two or t tip number three maybe would be um, focus on shoes that are pro highly profitable only in the beginning, but also that have a mass market appeal. So a Jordan one, right? Something that's going to move easily, something that's going to do really well. Or the second part of that is the very, very, very high demand shoes, which I don't think in the beginning you're going to have much success obtaining, but you never, you never know. I've seen some like first timers pull out a Travis Scott uh, win or, you know, somebody on the sneakers app that's only been doing it for a short period of time hit like an off white or something. Um, I hit three pairs of off-white Jordans this year, including the fours and the fives. I got multiple pairs of the fives on the uh, sneakers app this year. So this has just been an amazing year. I hit the fragments. Actually, 20, 2020 was an amazing year for sneakers for me. Um, business was good too in 2020. It just, it was a really weird year, as you guys know. So one, a couple more tips that I would say, you got to have a good um, phone and a good service that's going to have quick speed, inter good internet speed when you're not connected to Wi-Fi or when you're not at home. Because there are going to be times when the cook group gives you a notification and you're like walking around the mall or you're somewhere and, uh, you know, Travis Scott shock drops or an off-white Jordan shock drops or something. And you got to be able to move quick and you're having a good phone uh, with access to a Discord group cook group that I talked about is going to be critical. Uh, the last thing is that you just stay calm and you move quickly. A lot of people freak out and panic when it's drop time and their hands start shaking and they can't, you know, you need to be able to stay cool and calm and relaxed. And in the beginning when I was uh, starting out, I was not cool or calm during the drops and it didn't help. You know, I was fumbling around, my hands were shaking, you know, and I just couldn't make it happen. So calm, cool, and the last part, and this is probably uh, more advanced, is to have a really good computer set up and start learning about what applications you can use to do like autofill, stuff like that. That's not even getting into bots or anything like that. Just having a cook group, having solid apps on your phone, having a good device, being able to move quickly when there is a drop. And, you know, that's it. That's it. And you learn as you go. You figure out what sells, what doesn't. And then you start to build relationships around the industry. So those are the key things that I've done. It's basically allowed me to make, you know, somewhere between five hundred to a thousand dollars a month on sneakers if I want to. If I put in the time, if I put in the effort, you know, these are all off white Jordans up here. I'm sitting on those. I don't need to move them right away. I don't need the cash. It'd be nice to have, but I don't need it. Up there's a Travis uh, Scott Jordan one low. We've got some off whites up there some uh, Vantas, we've got some of the 380s. So I got a whole range of sneakers. See all these boxes over there? I got a storage unit upstairs. So these are things that I've bought over the past several years. A lot of success in sneakers. I actually just started a sneaker wall over here too, which is uh, brand new. You can see a couple really nice shoes in there. We got the Union Jordans, which I hit. We got the Jordan 4 Off-White down here. Travis Scott Low. I think those are the 500s. We've got the Bloodline GS, Purple Cats. we got, um, coming over here is the Edison Chen. we got the 700s. we got the Off-White Dunks. 
going even farther over, we got the Japan, we got the Quantums, we got the Clays. So, I mean, these are, those are shoes that I wear, but you know, the, there's always room for more in the investment um, space. You can always be investing in shoes and watching them go up. GS Jordan ones, gold mine, gold mine. So anyways, I wanted to get, get uh, this video out to you guys. I wanna make sure you guys hit up my Instagram if you're new here. A lot of giveaways are gonna go to my Instagram now. I really wanna build up my Instagram. Um, in fact, I just gave away some NBA hoops cards and I'm gonna be doing a lot more NBA hoops. I opened up about 100 fat cello packs of NBA hoops the other day. Got Jaw Morant, you know, I got some Zions, other Jaw, Tyler Hero. I got a butt, like a stack. I got stacks of cards, stacks. So maybe we'll talk more about cards. I'll talk to you guys about the investments I'm making, um, buying a lot of Zions right now. But uh, yeah, hit me up on Instagram at ShoeStockX, at Drew P. Holmes. And don't forget to DM me over there so I know who you are. See you guys soon.